What do we got? Single malt scotch whiskey. We like whiskey. Single malt scotch whiskey too. What? Single malt scotch whiskey too. Oh, you said single malt scotch whiskey. What? Okay. Yes. Why? 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 Why, why? why what? Why are you so mean? No, just that. <laughs> so, uh, we got the Glen Limit 15. We do. Is this the French oak? This is the French oak. The French oak. Okay. The Glimit. The Glimit. Glimit. See, you got the Glen Limit 15 year old single malt scotch whiskey gets its distinctive rich and exotic character from a process of selective maturation in which a proportion of the spirit is matured in French oak casks. In fact, Glen Limit. We're the first to use French oak for making whiskey, a technique that has since been imitated the world over. The limousine, 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 limousine. limousine. How about limo? The limo oak they limo use oak. is from France's Dordogne region, where it is often used to mature cognac. Its low density allows the whiskey to sink deep into the wood, and we they carefully control how long the whiskey matures in the casks so as not to overpower the desired result. Hmm. It's a unique, pleasing spiciness. Interesting. Okay. So nice color. It. Let's do it. Cheers. Cheers. You didn't want to keep the ham hocks down the bottom. It makes a nice ring. It does. You know, well, we've had a few whiskeys that are done with the, with the limousine oak. There was that oh. rye, the one from uh, Wisconsin. What the hell was that called? Can't remember the name of it now. It'll come to me. But that was a strictly limousine oak aged rye. That was very good. It smells spicy. It does. Spicy yet fruity. Like I'm getting like um, like peaches or maybe some berries of some sort. Maybe a little orange peel. Yeah, it almost smells like an old fashioned. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And it's uh, only forty percent ABV, but on the nose, it's a little uh, vapory too. Not too not too vapory though. No, but no, no singe, no burn. Bit. They suggest you pair this with full flavored venison dishes. Really? By any chance? Ooh, no. Would you happen to have? I got smoked whitefish. Would there be some venison sausages? I got some smoked whitefish. Yeah. I got some nuts. I got some right. uh, crackers. <laughs> oh, your crackers. I uh, got crackers. I got uh, almonds with dark chocolate. I have those. Would you like any of that? I didn't hear venison in that. I Sorry. suppose not. Sorry. Eggs? Ham? Eggs? <laughs> Eggs? Ham? I'm going with <sighs> Okay. I talk too much. Hmm. No. You know, again, we, we ask this question every single time. We have, we, we drink 50, 55, 57, 62. All these high APPs, and sometimes you get no burn. This one's 40. There's a good burn. Yeah, it's a good singe on the tongue there. Yeah, that's pretty yeah. good, though. It's got a nice little spice to it. It's got a nice spice. And a little woody. It's a little dry. A little oaky. A little dry. I'm like that. I'm getting a little pucker yeah. on the cheeks. Yeah. That, uh... Hmm. That'll do you. That's good. It's lightly sweet. I'm getting that like, like, like maybe peaches or like a strawberry tart or something like that. Like I'm getting that kind of a fruit. Are you getting With the baking spices too? A little bit. A little bit. Like maybe a little cinnamon. Yeah. You know, a little bit of vanilla. That's nice. You know, after the first sip, the, the that peppery bite kind of goes away. Mm -hmm. Not entirely. It's still kind of hot for forty percent. Yeah. That's, uh, boy, that's pleasant. That's this nice. is a good bit of sweetness, though. That's nice, yeah. It goes from, like, sweet yeah, yeah. to spicy. Yeah. You know, like, again, I get that fruit yeah. with a little bit of sugar yeah. and maybe a little cinnamon. And then I get that little kick on the end. Yeah. That's pretty good. Not like a very that. long finish, though. Hmm? Not a very long finish. You know, it's a drying yeah. finish. Yeah. It's not, like, a lingering spicy finish, but it is pretty dry. Yeah. Like, I'm getting a lot of, like, yeah. you know, like a little... That's a nice sip of pucker. Boy, that's good. Yeah, it's pretty good. Um, I'm thinking like 87. Yeah, make it a little higher. I'll yeah, make, make it like 87. Yeah, that's good. Oh, that's good. That's a solid A minus for me. Is it? That's I, good. I go B plus. I, like, I go B plus on that. Big fan of the Glen Limits. Yeah, I like it. You know what I haven't had in a while? The Nadora. Nadora. Oh, Nadora is good. That was one of your. That was yeah, your dad's favorite. Yeah. Yeah, it was one of his favorites. The Nadora. Yeah, it was good. It was good. So I've had this mini for like I don't know two years yeah. sitting around, and you said you had a full size bottle. Yeah, for about as long. Yeah, so I figured let's kick the mini. It did not go bad. No, not <laughs> at all. Not at all. So, all right. So I'm going B plus. You're yeah, going, going A minus. minus yeah. All right, cool. Cheers. Cheers to you. Cheers to Glenn Livett. And, uh, you know, keep doing what you do, folks. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Cheers. Mm -mm.